Well, for many people, there's nothing like a big burst of flavor to wake up your taste buds. And limes can do just that. CBS 2's Stephanie Tantillo may have found the perfect recipe and preparation. Limes are a great way to add dimension to so many different dishes. When you see limes in the store, here's what you want to look for when you pick them out. They should be this nice, beautiful, vivid green. They have such a great color to them. Don't compromise that. And then if you see a couple of little blemishes, that's okay. That won't really change the flavor, but make sure to avoid any decaying spots or any soft spots. They should always be heavy for their size, and when you bring limes home, store them in the refrigerator. They'll last for about a week, but the longer you leave them in there, the more they start to lose their flavor. So what we're going to do with these is we're going to try them in a Thai soup. Pure Thai Cookhouse on 9th Avenue is an authentic Thai shop house style restaurant. Hey everybody, welcome to Pure Thai Cookhouse. I'm here with Chef Bobby, so what are we going to make? Uh, today we're going to make like a soup suko Thai mm -hmm. yeah, for like a little bit sweet and spicy. So it's a lot of taste in the soup and this is one of your signature dishes, right? Yes. The first thing I have to cook and with uh, noodle. Uh -huh. What kind of noodles are they? Like a rice noodle. So you just steam them really quick? Yes, really quick. Oh, okay. Like a 10 seconds. And then some fresh long beans. And then right. the next one is going to be tofu. That's tofu? Yes. Okay. Just like crispy tofu and uh, dry shrimp. Mm -hmm. And then uh, let go or Asian slurry. Okay. <laughs> and then going to be palm sugar. Is that lime juice? Lime juice. Okay. And then uh, fish sauce. Two fish sauce. Mm -hmm. That's a lot of flavors. Yeah, right. A lot of different flavors. Yeah. Ones, and then uh, peanut. All right. And then uh, uh, pork rot. Okay. The hot pork rot in uh, soup. And you use that stock for a lot of stuff, right? Yes. All right. Mix it up and then put it in, in the bowl. Beautiful. Roast pork's going to go right in there. And then a little bit cracking. Mm -hmm. This soup will stay sweet with these ingredients, but if you want a fiery kick, it has the potential to be spicy as well. All right, well, thanks, Bobby, for showing us how to make this quick and easy soup. Packed with so much flavor. CBS 2 News, I'm Stephanie Tantillo. Oh, wow. That's yep. fantastic. Looks good. That's just mean to show that. To us right <laughs> Not now. give us We're any. We're kind of hungry too. We want some. <laughs>